Hello and welcome back. Welcome back. John and old uh, YouTuber and PC gamer. I have rebooted my computer because this Adobe the Adobe Acrobat reader did not like to read the full documents. I don't know why, but now I just start to reboot and it close all the PDF, but now I have I have it on my list there. But I was just reading about uh, East Germany, some uh, CPUs from East Germany and computers from the Eastern Germany, East Germany and East Germany. So I find that other one called Elektroapparateverke. That's the East Germany, uh, my semiconductor electronic factory, so I like to record that. So and after that. I will do the Motorola and the Motorola 68000 chips. So let's uh, log in. And open the Adobe Acrobat. And uh, open a uh, I think you call it uh, path pathfinder. Is open the this German electro. Electro apparatus work, yes, but every time I finish recording, every time I, I have to spend time to move uh, PDF around and look my list, update my list and notes and stuff. So I like to read it now, that's only two pages, so that's very good, that's not 20. So that's less 20 minutes. So I will uh, go back to my bed and eat something more to drink. So I just finished uh, the East Germany. East Germany computers a little bit, but not much because I like to, uh, to read the insults. I'm not going to spend three months, half a year, because that would take many months and years to read this many thousand of pages. Let's see if it's working. Activate, activate voice, read, read to end of the documents. Electro apparate work. Electro apparate work, EAW. Type Volkseigenabatry of Industry Electronics Manufacturer Computer Software founded October 21, 1946 inches Berlin, German Democratic Republic Fate converted into Corporation Headquarters Berlin, German Democratic Republic Products Electrical Appliances number of employees 8000. Electro apparate work trepto at night, 1951. The Electro Apparate Work, EAW, was a state-owned industrial operation of the German Democratic Republic, DDR East Germany. It was a successor of the combined VEB Electro Apparate Work, VEB, and, with more than 8,000 employees, Wason of the largest manufacturers of electrical appliances in the DDR. The site of the former headquarters in the Berlin suburb of Old Trepto is since 1998 the location of the Trep Towers, the Berlin offices of Allianz SE. History EAW originated from the Apparate Work Berlin Trepto, at, founded by AEG in 1928. During World War II the company manufactured radio equipment for bombers and U-boats and navigational devices for V-2 rockets. Its factory was largely destroyed by Allied bombing raids. One, at was taken over as a Soviet Aktion Gesellschaft, 
Sag. On the 21st of October, 1946, Andre named Elektroapparate Work Berlin Trepto, EAW. After the death of Stalin, the company was renamed Elektroapparate Work JW Stalin. On the 31st of December, 1953, the works changed the legal form from an SAG to a nationally owned company, Volkszeichene Betrieb, in 1960, as part of the Stalinization. The name was changed to VEBEAW Berlin Trepto Friedrich Ebert after the former socialist president of Germany. In the 1980s Amriel Clark was installed at the administration building for communist athlete Werner Seelenbinder. Two EAW also provided polytechnic training for students of neighboring schools in Trepto. The class in productive work was taught through a practical project. The water tower at the Ostkrus station was in a poorly maintained hut, with heating problems in winter. The project taught the theory of socialist production and practical solutions of production tasks. Practical student work included the construction of indoor fountains for the people's use. A second location for the productive work lessons was Karl Kunger Street in Trepto. For the qualification of the employees, the EAW maintained a training school, also in Karl Kunger Street. Their sales skills were taught with a focus on vocational qualification. Also annual refreshers were held for monotonous tasks of unskilled people, as in the production of refrigerator relays. Compulsory physical education of two hours per week for the entire staff took place in company facilities inside and on the outdoor grass and gravel courts in Baum School and Week. Also the various sports associations met there, notably the Handball Association, and weekly sports instruction took place. View at Berlin Treptower Park Station. In the background, Electroapparate Work J.W. Stalin, 1958. The EAW was also a workplace and rehabilitation site for prisoners from Rummelsburg Prison, not far from the relay factory on Hofmannstrasse. In 1990, following German reunification, the organization was transformed into EAW Berlin GmbH and was privatized in 1993. Unfortunately, the company was burdened with excess employees and a line of dated, expensive, and unreliable products. Attempts to diversify into consumer electronics and build products that could compete in the world market failed. One, from the former organization, independent mid-sized enterprises emerged. The EAW Vocational School closed in the early 1990s. Products. P8000 running Wega 3.1 EAM manufactured measuring instruments rectifiers, relays, circuit breakers, vacuum switches, instrumentation and control engineering, electric meters, radios, and computers. EAW was the manufacturer of power system distance protection equipment in East Germany. Three, the last consumer products were the Audio 145 stereo radio cassette recorder, the SKR 701 stereo cassette recorder, 4, and the P8000 16-bit microcomputer, based on the East German U8000 clone of the Xilog Z8000, 1, running a Unix clone called Wiga.5, references. 1 E German businesses see tough times after merger. Yes, Sun Sentinel. Retrieved the 11th of September, 2000. Stop. Last edit, April last year, that is one year ago. So uh, I will just upload this, let's keep the video below uh, 10 minutes.